Welcome back, folks. This is Athletes Incorporated. Catch us on IVTV.us, Roku TV, YouTube. Comment, subscribe. Um, and I'm Trey. This is my co-host, Farrell Johnson. And we're going to hop right into it. A lot has been going on. Uh, the NBA honors, I'm going to read them off to you and see what you think about them. The MVP of the league was James Harden. They almost had to give it to him this yep. year, man. He's been his third year in a row. Third year. Third year in a row. And he was deserving. Right. I had a thought, too, before we go any further, folks. Um, Russell Westbrook, Kevin Durant, and James Harden, all drafted in OKC, all won MVPs. What do you? What does that say about the GM? And that well, this is that the administration is not the brightest. Mm -hmm. There's no way that those three should not have been kept together right. forever. Right. And the reason I believe Durant left was when they let James Harden go. Right. Whatever he was asking, they should have come up with. Because those three now would be. Oh, can you imagine him playing the Warriors every year? Wow. LeBron wouldn't even be in the mix. mix yeah. He wouldn't even be in the mix. Okay, let's hit it. Keep, keep, going. keep it moving. Okay, so now we've got the Rookie of the Year, which I think was a snub. Ben Simmons won the Rookie of the Year. It was the second year. Second was Donovan Mitchell. From you know, Utah. From Utah. I think he was the Rookie of the Year. I think he was, too. I think he's the Rookie of the Year. I think he was, too. And, and I think Ben Simmons had a great year, yeah. but he deserved about as much as uh, uh, the kid from the Celtics. Right. I mean, he was right there with him also, right. but... The kid from Utah, that was special over the years. It's just that he's not in a big enough market. Right. Had he been in a big market. And points so, per game, Ben Simmons, 15.8. Points per game, 20.5. Donovan Mitchell. Oh, wow. So, big snub. And Donovan Mitchell put that team on his back. Oh, yeah. yeah. You've seen him. Yeah. And they'll be back next year, oh, too. Yeah. Most improved player um, player would be Victor Aladimpo. And... Um, He's a great player. He actually came back. He was played for IU mm -hmm. and was drafted big. Um, used to play with the Magic, so he's a great player. We're, we're super happy for him. Uh, we also got the Defensive Player of the Year winner, which is Rudy Gobert. If you guys don't know about him, he's a monster on the boards, rebounds, blocks. And, of course, only won that because Kyrie. Kyrie, yep. Because, I mean, Kawhi Leonard yep. wasn't playing. Yep. You're but right. he's right there with him. I mean, yeah, he's a great one. He's a great one. And sixth man of the year, Lou Williams. It's the second sixth second, man. Second year. Lou Will is a beast. There's no, you don't even have to say anything about him. And another snub, coach of the year would have been Dwayne Casey. And Brad Stevens was second in the voting for the Celtics. So who they, they gave it to? Dwayne Casey. The Raptors. From, from the Raptors. Yeah. Which is pretty crazy that you're, I, you're I coach know. of the year and you get fired. Yeah. But you know what? It's good for him. And... I think he'll move on to bigger and better because I think he's done everything he can do up there. Right. Uh, but still, to, wow, to let the coach of the year go. would we'll just let you know that uh, if you don't win right now, they will get rid of you. Well, it reminds me of the Nuggets. Who had the Carl, uh, George Carl? Right. Coach of the year. They got rid of him, and they've been running through coaches like yeah. him since. That's right. So, That's right. yeah. If you got folks don't know, also right now we've got the opening of free agency yesterday. So yesterday, and one of the first dominoes to fall was Paul George said he's going to be staying in OKC, yeah. and um, yeah, Carmelo staying in KC. Russell Westbrook's going to be there. Right. They're going to be a good team. Where does LeBron James go now? Does LeBron James still go to the Lakers? I don't know because now we know that uh, Paul George is not coming home, and he said he wanted to come home so bad. Uh, I think San Antonio is going to do everything that they have to do to keep uh, Kawhi Leonard. So that's the next big domino. And folks, if you don't know, Kawhi Leonard wanted to come out. He wanted to leave. George Popovich flew out to L.A. to meet with him. Right. And everything seemed to be going fine right. since then. Because probably what he's telling now, man, is the time of uh, uh, Popovich, just like the time of the Bobby Knight type coaches, right. he was the last. Right. And now he's going to have to change or he'll lose more right. than Kawhi Leonard. Right. There's going to be no more total dictatorships and talking to people any way you want to right. and embarrassing people. And I really like Popovich. I really like that he's so socially aware right. and has the courage to come out and say things. Um, by the way, folks, uh, shout out to all of the folks yesterday that got out and protested with the immigration that's going on. Shout out to those yeah. folks. And that's yeah. the kind of person that uh, Popovich is. I really love that he does that. But he's going to have to change. If he flew out there, that's way different. Right. And if he flew out there and he talked and said, hey, man, we can get this together, I think that Kawhi will stay. So that's the next domino. The last big domino of the free agents mm -hmm. is... Um, 
think that's it. It's yeah, Kyrie okay. and, and Melo stand. Yeah. Nobody and cares so about Melo personally, but I, I don't know where LeBron would would land. We know he can't go. They they mentioned Celtics. That's out of the question. Yes, he can't go to the Celtics. If you were the GM and it's a new GM with uh, uh, Philly, right. all the trouble they've had, right. why you would have that great young crew and bring LeBron James, who would pretty much ego wise destroy some of those right. kids because they're going to get back and this is my team. Uh, maybe he could go up to, I've heard, maybe the Wizards. Yeah. Uh, maybe go up there. Pelicans. Um, 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 but the Pelicans, I don't think. Because, you know, um, it was very, one of the things with, uh, what's the big guy that got hurt with Cousins? Cousins. Demarcus with Cousins. Cousins is his ability or inability to get along with everyone. He's with a group of guys that he really likes, likes and they like yeah. him. I don't think LeBron James coming in with that little behind the back bully type stuff and pushing you, right. that's not gonna work with him. That's not gonna, and so why would you mess that up? I don't, and I don't think he wants to be in New Orleans anyway. You, you know Just that. geographically. <clears throat> so does he beg his way in with the Houston Rockets? Because they said that CP likes him so yeah. much. I don't think James Harden would like him though. Yeah, yeah, you know, man. So you know, it's it's going to be tough. You and know, then you know if, I, I had if he goes to L.A., that if with what's going on now, if he goes to L.A., the ball circus stays there. But you get you got Julius Randle there. There's some other young boys that are pretty good. Mm -hmm. You can still build around that team. So he could still go to L.A. But like we said in the car, the Nuggets would be as good as team as any. The, Trey Lyles, Gary House, Jokic. I mean, you got Nuggets, some young boys that are coming the up. Nuggets would you still be, got Kenneth Vereen. I mean, uh, they would be a better fit if he's going to leave. Right now, I don't know that folks. It would make uh, make sense for him to leave Cleveland. Yeah. Uh, Kevin Young, uh, if uh, Kevin. Uh, uh, Love comes back healthy, uh, and he wants to go to the West Coast. He they wants said to. He, they said he wants, he wants to, to go. Now he's not up for, for that next year. Next year, it's next year. But LeBron, he's he's running out of time. He's running out of time. If uh, they they say no way, but New York could be a good spot. They got the great young player Porzingis, but they need one more person. I don't know who who the third person would be, but that's a, a big venue. I think it's going to be really funny because people probably laugh at it. All of this uh, hoorah around, he'll probably end up staying in Cleveland, and they're going to try to get someone. Who would they get, though? Who would you think they could get? Who's even available? That's the thing. Yeah. The free agents that are available are not big-name, big-time players. Right. Because the, the ones that were, were are going to stay put. And we talked about this in the car, folks, but I think this also shows that Everybody, LeBron James, in his class, they have different values than he does. He wants to win championships. It's clear for Paul George, it's about the money. Melo, it's about the money. Yeah. Russ, it's about the money. It's yeah. about the most money you can yeah. get. Yeah. Uh, and then the other people, the other people, Kevin Durant, the Steph Curry, yeah, because, you know, they the, just want to have fun and they have they like the, the rumor was with. that he reached out to Kevin Durant. What about us getting to Greg? <laughs> Kevin Durant said, "Why would I do that?" Right. <laughs> Why would I leave here and come to Cleveland? It's going beautiful for me out here. I'm happy. I'm making the money I need to make. Mm -hmm. We are the world champions. Why would I leave here? But you know, so it's 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 clear that people can see. If he can't see, people can see that it's his time's coming to an end. Right. So. I don't know, man. Stay and he's there. talking crazy about playing with his son, and so, you heard about that. No, That's a whole yeah, story for him. I mean, you know, stay, son. stay in Cleveland. Yeah. Cement your legacy for the the state and the city. Mm -hmm. uh, they'll find someone to come in. Uh, they 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 will make the playoffs again, but they won't make it to the final round. Uh, Cleveland, if he stays in Cleveland, Cleveland is uh, uh, well, whatever happens, Cleveland's right. not making it to the final. Quick, quick, we're running out of time, folks. But gun to your head, if he doesn't stay in Cleveland, where does he go? If you were a betting man, where does he go? If I were betting and he had to go somewhere, I would say they fix something to go to Houston. If I'm betting, he goes to LA. I think um, Magic does. I think Magic wines and dines him and say they're going to build some great team around him. But he doesn't have time to build. I know. He's, I know. Yeah, he's, he's got to come into a situation where it's made to order for him, folks. Yeah. But uh, that's our first segment, folks. Uh, stick around. We'll be right back. Have lots more to talk about.